Hi, it's Jason Pinto of Interlink One with a fellow developer, Peter Jensen. Hi. Uh, what we want to do is show you a new enhancement to our marketing fulfillment software, and that is with barcode scanning functionality. Um, we already have a web-based system that lets you add inventory, fulfill orders, create pick tickets. Well, if you've got barcode scanners and it makes life easier for you, well, now you can use the Interlink One system easier than ever. So what do we got here, Pete? Well, the first thing that we got is the device itself. Uh, this happens to be a Motorola MC9090. Um, it's important to note that it, you, de you, don't, you don't necessarily need to have uh, the scanning functionality. You can use like the keyboard on the device, but it's much, much easier to, to actually scan. Um, beyond that, we have our, our warehouse set up. You know, like this is, this is a, uh, like a shelf. These are the bins, each of which we've um, gone ahead and added barcodes to them, right? Uh, so yeah, this is sort of our, our, mock, our mock warehouse. All right, so for the mock warehouse, you also need product. So let's pretend you just got a new shipment of power cords that you're going to store. All right, so we went ahead and we added barcodes to the power cords. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click uh, Adjustments, the Adjustments menu. Adjustment. And first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to scan the inventory location and then scan the product, right? I'm gonna enter in the adjustment amount, so I have three power cords, and I'm gonna click adjust. So we'll add our three power cords to inventory. Simple as that. Now, so when you did that, that updates our web-based software, the database and everything? Yeah, absolutely. Unbelievable. Yeah. All right, so we can add inventory. Now, of course, hopefully things fly off shelves and stuff. Absolutely. Can you remove? Of course. All right. And remove is uh, very similar. Again, you, you scan the location, scan the product, you enter in the, the adjustment quantity, and click adjust, and click your adjustment type. And that happens again in the warehouse reflected live. Unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. All right, so I saw you use the um, your little pen to put in an amount. Can you also use the keyboard for that? You can. Okay. All right, so those are just a couple basic things that you might need to do in the warehouse. Hopefully we've made it easier with our barcode scanning functionality. If you have any questions, go to our website, interlink1.com. Thank you, Pete. Thank you.